How you doing, Chilla Cal? Well, I'm here in Vegas and it happened again. Another mass shooting, somebody crazy or went crazy, decided to take it out on the world instead of taking it out on themselves or getting help. People who um, are against gun control or against mental health have no answer for these uh, things. And people who can do something about it, our senators, our congressmen and women, they don't do anything about it until it's too late or until it affects them. I just don't, I just don't understand, you know? Nobody understands. And when it happens, we throw up uh, sorrow and a, and a bunch of prayers. And y'all know me, I'm, I believe in God more than anything. But prayers without works, without deeds, nothing. So what are we going to do? Just going to keep letting this happen. Um, keep not voting. And uh, keep crying, running. The thought of these children who are trying to get ready for finals, trying to get ready to go home for the holidays, will never see their homes again. And the ones who are gonna see their homes, their lives are gonna be changed forever. So, is it just the American way? Is it the new world way? I hope not. I hope everybody, um, the youth, the people in schools, are tired of having to get used to alerts on their phones and drills and our children uh, even younger than that having to learn to jump under a desk and put desk in front of doors and turn off lights and things like that and instead of all of us having to get trained and used to this I hope the people who can do something about it do something I mean we all know it's sick no, I don't know, it's terrible. But I think we're getting kind of numb to it, you know? We're all used to it. It's something we should never, ever have to or be used to or get used to. We're kind of getting used to it, you know? Turn on the news. Who got shot today? You know, aside, aside from the mass shootings, just children and people just getting shot all day. Can, can we start anywhere? I, you know, there's no, not even laws on limiting how many guns you can have, you know? You know, um, I mean, to me, five, ten guns is uh, way more too much. One or two, you know, is all you need. But to the dude in Mississippi, Texas, someplace, you know, they probably have five or ten in their car. So, uh, it's, you know, but shouldn't we start it somewhere? Can we start somewhere? Like, say, hey, there's a limit. How about a thousand? Is there any reason people should have a thousand guns? Can we at least write a law there? Start there. I mean, this is ridiculous, but when you think about it, we don't even have that. Can we just say, okay, a thousand guns is too much. Then maybe a year from there, six months from there, or a year or two from there, we say, let's bring that down to 500. And then a hundred. And then you got to be trained to have this type of gun or something. I mean, something. I, I don't know. I don't know the answer. All I know is you got to vote some people in that are thinking way bigger than the ones who are in there are now because here we go again. Here we freaking go again.